I am going to be opening up the brand new Spider-Man No Way Home Upper Deck Hobby Box. Let's get into it. <laughs> All right, so this had just recently come out. I believe so because I went to my LCS and they said it was new. So I decided to pick one up considering I, I love opening up this kind of stuff. Some favorite movies and Spider-Man No Way Home top tier marvel movie probably one of the best movies that they have made in the past couple years for sure and i know that everybody would probably agree with me on that but today i'm going to be opening up the box i looked at the checklist beforehand and it's actually pretty good honestly the only thing that i will say is that toby Maguire does not have autographs in this set so it's just andrew garfield i believe that's this is andrew Gar is this andrew garfield this is tom holland I want to say that's this is toby mcguire right here but that's besides the point i'm just going to open this up while i'm talking i don't know where my razor blade is uh oh oh here it is got it so yeah toby mcguire does not have autographs but tom holland and andrew garfield both do uh dr strange has an autograph autographs in here Aunt may has autographs the green goblin sandman so pretty much and then i believe ned's ned has ned has some autos and Zendaya does not. Zendaya does not have any autos in here. But that's all right. Because we are hunting either... Honestly, if you get any auto, I feel as though it's a pretty damn good auto. Considering the checklist. Look at that. We have the Green Goblin on the front of the pack. That is beautiful. Make sure not to damage this box so I can put it in the back. But yeah, you get... What is, what is it? Uh, six cards per pack, 15 packs per box. Autographs are pretty hard to come by honestly so i'm just hoping i don't get a manufactured patch i hate those freaking things they piss me off so much but yeah let's just get right into it uh there are one ones there are oh my god thank god i thought i had a i thought i had a patch in here and this pack is stuck Jeez. all right so just to go over the base real quick and i saw the insert there but here's the base looks pretty clean honestly you got spider-man looks like spider-man with a gold border there's the back pretty clean card design not gonna lie i, I want to say they're all like this but yeah we got another one here i'm not gonna name every single base but yeah i don't know what so this is ned so i guess a character card jacob Batalon as ned leads sure Move this back we get another base card here and then we have a foiled out there's another that one's different see this one's different this one got to be careful when you're opening these because they literally look the same but this one has blue so i don't know this might be it's not numbered but it's definitely an insert for sure because it's blue and this one is numbered for sure so this one is numbered so we have this tom holland as spider-man chromed out card it is numbered 288 out of 299 so 11 off of the last one printed that looks sick i'm not going to lie i opened up the spider-man into the spider-verse i didn't get a number card but we have one here so i will definitely take that for sure and i don't know what you're guaranteed but we are going to hope for the best here we got the osborne green goblin we got him trying to save Max. We got the lizard here. And we have a canvas card. So we got the lizard here. And we have another blue back here. So I guess you get one blue every pack. And we have a canvas card. Now this looks sick. We have Doc Ock, UD Canvas. It looks It's literally the same thing as Upper Deck Series 1, Series 2 Hockey. You get the canvas card. It literally has UD Canvas on it. But yeah. That looks sick. Got a Doc Ock canvas card. Nice. I actually really enjoyed this movie when it came out. I'm not a super big Marvel guy, but this was definitely phenomenal. Like I said in the beginning. I'm not even going over there. There he is. Jameson. And then we have another canvas card. So yeah, you do get one below every pack. We have another canvas card, Spider-Man. That looks sick. That looks sick. So, got that there. Next pack 
here. We got Sunday on the front. Nice. You're not Peter Parker. Another base, base. Okay. So we got another blue. And this looks like a Sinister Auto. So maybe something for the Sinister Six. I don't know. It's not numbered, but that looks sick. I'm not going to lie. I'm liking these inserts so far. I'm liking these inserts the way they look. Definitely liking them so far. Next pack here. Fuck, we have a thick card in here. Please don't be a freaking patch. Please don't be a patch. Should I save it? I'm gonna save it. I wanna be toxic. I wanna be toxic today. I wanna be Los Toxico today. It's probably just a stupid patch, but you never know. It might be autographed. It might be autographed. Oh, so we got a red in here. So we got Andrew Garfield as Spider Man. We got. Doctor Strange fighting Spider-Man. And we have a red insert, which is not numbered. So I guess you got blue and red there. Same thing as WandaVision. You get, there was purple and red, not numbered. So maybe this is the same same type of setup. I'm not sure, but maybe, maybe this is a mess. I'm making a mess, but I don't care. Osborne again. Spider-Man. Feels like we had that pack before. Look at this, three character cards. Okay, look at that. So I guess you can, yeah, so they're parallels to the base. So we got a red and blue. We got the red of Doctor Strange and the blue of the Green Goblin. These are not numbered, right? They are not. So I guess you just get them whenever. I don't know. Sure. I don't even know what I was trying to say there, but next pack. Next pack. Seems we're getting the same base cards again already. So we probably have another canvas card here. We do. So it's a sideways, there's a blue. So we have a sideways, we have a, what is it, horizontal? Oh, no. Is it, yeah, horizontal. Got to go back to fifth grade math for that one. We have a horizontal Spider-Man canvas. That's nice. I do like the canvases a lot. They, they look clean. I like the white. Looks like a color blast if you collect whatever sport they're in anything but hockey i believe so we got a character card on the front toby there's toby mcguire sucks that he doesn't have autos in here but base 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 so we've got a blue here and then we have a sinister so maybe it's just doc ock i don't know we got so this one's here so maybe maybe it is just doc ock i'm not sure but they do look sick not going to lie Next pack here. Base. So we got Green Goblin character card here. We got base, base. And we have a. The heck is this? So we got a blue there. What is this? So we have a FC1. It looks like a piece of film. Films. I guess a film film card from the movie but this is it's literally an acetate card so i'm not sure you could see right through it see but yeah i don't know what this is i don't know what the hit odds are this but it's zendaya so we'll take it for sure for sure we will take that for sure for sure for sure if i can get this next pack open jesus come on my g this is unbelievable i'm embarrassed i'm embarrassed Embarrassing. So we got more base. Who cares? Oh, there's Aunt May. There's Aunt May right there. Let's go. I am Spider Man. And we have a behind the scenes. So we got another blue. We got the blue of Sandman here. So we have a behind the scenes card. I guess this is just showing you what it looks like without the effects. But. Yeah, that's cool, I guess. I guess, eh. I'm not really a big fan of that one. I'd rather have a canvas card. For sure. For sure. Base, who cares? Who cares? We got another Tom Holland. Nice. Looks like we got another canvas here. We do not. I was wrong. So we got a blue here. And we have a Spider-Man exclusive. Who is Peter Parker? Public enemy number one. 
that looks cool. Looks like a, so I guess it says page three here. So maybe it's a, maybe it's a, oh, that says page two. Maybe it's a newspaper type set. I'm not sure, but that's very cool. All right, next pack. I'm liking this opening so far. Definitely my favorite Marvel box I've opened out of all the ones I've opened easily. So we got blue. Then we got in action, Thomas Hayden Church's Sandman. So we got Sandman in action here. Looks like an in action card. Okay. With two packs left, and then we'll reveal whatever that stupid patch card is. I'm assuming it's just a manufactured patch. Pain in my ass. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. And we got Ned. What's up, Ned? We got a blue there. We got Ned behind the scenes. Okay, buddy. You love to see a little, a little Ned action. You love to see it. All right, last pack. Here. Last pack. We got base. We got Doctor Strange. And we got base. We just looks like we have a red and a blue in this pack. All right. So, let's see, I kind of, kind of messed up here. All right, so take that off. We got a blue here. Peter one, Peter two, Peter three. We got all of them swinging in action. This seems as the logo patches. God damn it. I hate this shit so much. It's so stupid. It is so stupid. I hate this shit so much. Excuse my French. It's literally just a manufactured patch. Like, who cares? Who cares about these cards? It literally, you just throw a character, you literally throw a character from the movie on there and say it's a manufactured patch. Enjoy. It's not even memorabilia. They didn't wear it. They didn't, they didn't touch it. They, it probably wasn't even on set, honestly. It's just a manufactured, it doesn't even, I don't know. What do you guys think? Let me know down below. I hate this shit though. I hate it so much. I'd rather take a canvas card over this, to be honest with you. But yeah. That's it. It's literally a mess. But thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Hope you're doing well. I think that's it.